Having dealt with sound files, this is probably one of the coolest VFX I've ever seen on a mount. What's up dudes and dudes in the internet, my name's Seth and today we are gonna be taking a look at some Trove mods. Oh my goodness, we've got a couple of them today that are kind of all in the same theme, right? So before we get started, we very much appreciate if you would hit that like button for me, helps me out more than you know. This mount was actually created by X Tries Go and is the Echo Wave Cycle and it replaces the Neon Knight Cycle and it's just amazing, like if you, especially if you have the Double Mancer costume, I would highly recommend checking this one out links will be in the description for all this stuff uh, and then the costume we've actually got a few different costumes to check out all are going to replace the level 20 costume for the neon ninja uh, the neon nightblade sword and the shadow so you kind of gotta pick and choose which one you actually want to rock or if you know a thing or two about modding you could just kind of rename some of the files so that they're not conflicting and then you could have them all running at once but either way Awesome costumes designed by Cryo GX. This is the Conduit costume. And not only does it look very Daft Punk and very cool and stuff like that, but he's actually got very, very nice custom VFX that really suit the costume. Like this kind of seems like a rave with lasers and stuff like that. Even our backflip is all cool. Dashing forward is kind of like a big sound wave attack. And then even using our ult is just so awesome to have that nice little sound bite playing out of it. And uh, also, let me see if I can get it to trigger right here. But if you wait on the uh, ultimate's cooldown. He actually has custom uh, VFX for that as well, which is about to show up. Bam! Isn't that amazing? So now we're gonna swap over to one of his other costumes. This one is hypersonic and definitely one of my all-time favorite. I love the fact that it's like a DJ kid thing, you know? And he actually ended up making it so that the helmet itself kind of has the character's hair, which is really, really neat. Not to mention he's got some fantastic color choices, very neon styled. Uh, the VFX are very similar to the other costumes. Some, some of it is actually a little bit changed, uh, but not really that much. And it's gonna be the same type of VFX for the ultimate, except it's got like the flame coming out of it instead. Uh, I'm also curious to see what happens when our ultimate kind of re-triggers. Is this gonna just be the same thing? Yeah, so it's very, very similar to the other one, but this one's absolutely awesome. Last but not least, DJ Neon Extreme, which this is totally a throw out to Daft Punk, isn't it? It's so beautiful though, I love it. It makes him look a little bit more sinister, like this would be kind of like a, a bad guy, like your arch rival if Trove actually had like a story or something like that, you know? VFX are very similar, uh, but it seems like he's kind of got a little bit more, like a lot more contrasting on this one. So it's kind of like, well, you can kind of just see it for yourself, right? And then when you do your ult, it's kind of like exploding fireballs everywhere. Uh, let's see, hopefully I have enough potions to get the ultimate to kind of re-trigger here again. And bloop, bloop. Absolutely awesome costumes. Links will be in the description for all of it. A great mount as well. I, I think that these all very much complement each other and I would love to see all of these make themselves, uh, make their way into the game. Just because, I mean, it seriously is absolutely awesome, man. Like the these guys did a fantastic job. Thanks so much for watching though, everybody. Sign and stay epic.